Hey, what's going on everyone? Vega here for Serpent X Tech. Got a quick one for you. Uh, recently on the 27th, uh, Pat PC Gamer wrote to Pat Gensler uh, advising that Intel is their only hope out of this nightmarish GPU crisis. We all know that GPU prices is still crazy. Uh, it's been years of this now and it's getting absolutely ridiculous. So Roger Dory responded to PC Gamer noting that this is a huge issue for PC gamers and the industry at large. Intel Graphics is working hard to find a path towards the mission and getting millions of ARC GPUs into the hands of gamers every year. Uh, video cards goes on to uh, add a little bit here. And we all know that due to component and substrate shortages, increasing cryptocurrency value, and millions of people working from home now have all contributed to this shortage or crisis. And it's been more than a year since the problem really emerged. And the graphics cards are actually available, but they're at absolutely nut prices as you know especially in the secondhand market ebay uh however this pricing is supposedly slowly declining while cryptocurrencies are facing a massive drop in value which cryptocurrency values have dropped quite a bit from its all-time highs across the board this in addition to the upcoming ethereum switch to proof of stake or the merge as they call it nvidia and amd releasing new entry-level gpus can finally provide some hope for normality now the gpus that intel and or excuse me that nvidia and amd recently released 6500 xt and a 3050 are not attractive to miners so that should help out gamers quite a bit uh intel has been suspiciously quiet about the arc discrete gpus the company has not provided any new information at ces 2022 but it looks like q1 2022 availability is still the target unfortunately intel did not however confirm when gamers will be actually able to buy these gpus but as i mentioned roger kadori is looking for a solution to ship millions of these gpus every year to gamers now one of the biggest things is that nvidia amd maybe not them directly but their partners are shipping batches bulk pallets of these gpus to big farms warehouses stuff like that not the at-home miner they have to compete with gamers alike just to get a gpu at all um, each quarter millions of gpus are being shipped by add-in board partners to gamers and system integrators by adding another few million gpus each year intel will certainly have a positive effect on the market intel has said many times that arc gpus in a multi-year plan that involves cooperation from not only the foundry but board partners gamers and game studios so intel could possibly be our only hope to kind of normalize this GPU situation, uh, put these prices back down to normal, along with cryptocurrencies decline, as well as the switch of Ethereum, the most profitable cryptocurrency, to move to proof of stake, no longer mineable or proof of work, should help alleviate some of that. I have seen personally pricing drop down on these GPUs, uh, but we just have to wait and see how things ship out when Intel starts shipping these GPUs in late Q1 2022. I probably would delay that to maybe Q2 2022, but we'll just have to wait and see. What's your thoughts? Let us know down in the comments below. Make sure to do me a favor on the way out. Hit the like button, get subscribed, hit the notification bell to stay up to date, and I will catch you in the next one. Take care.